Good morning. So I am just getting started on working on a cover of the Angry Video Game Nerd theme. And uh, yeah, I just bought the song and I am figuring out the tempo right now. I think it's like one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So I'm here tapping the tempo. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three. All right, so it's like 109. So let's do that. Let's see how that feels. Got my template loaded up. I'm going to choose. So let's hear how that sounds. Nice. Okay. That feels about right. So save this first. AVGN theme. And let's see. I have the song here that I wanted to bring in just for extra tempo purposes. Actually, you know what? I want to do the opposite. Tempo, supply, region tempo to project tempo. Let's see what happens here. A rotten asshole, a baroque kill skunk, and down it with me. He's the angriest gamer you've ever heard. So this version is, you know, the, the full extended version that's different from the actual YouTube theme slightly. So it might take some, some finagling here and there, but I am going to figure out what the drums are. So here we go. I need like a little buildup. Okay, so bum 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 bum. Let me think. Uh, search here. Five, six, seven, eight. So I'm here tapping the tempo. Let's do basic rock. One fourteen. Perfect. So I want that like snare intro. Actually, I wonder if I can find that as a fill. So let's go back to this. Angry video gamer. Okay, so one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Oops, you up here. Got that. You in. So. Okay. 
actually, you know what? I could use, I could use these. Yeah, so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take these pre-existing hits here because they have all of that human feel and you know dynamics of a real player because a real player actually played this beat. So I'm gonna use that. I'm not gonna waste it because I suck at like you know maneuvering you know hits into specific locations where it feels really natural because I am not a drummer, so I don't really have that sensibility. So here's what I'm gonna do. Let's hear how that sounds. See how the hits aren't perfectly lined up. That'll allow for a more, you know, human feel. So you, I will just double. Option click. And then that can be the ba ba boom. All right, so how am I gonna do this? Just raise the velocity slightly each time. down let's see Six, seven eight, 81 bring it down to like 90 yeah, do that Crank that. Bring you up, bring you down. See, this could be a tedious process, which is why I like to avoid it. Let's see, let's crank you up. Seven. I will work on refining that later. Okay. So back in the session and after doing some digging, I figured I would just pull from the most basic of grooves. Um, I think this is from Easy Drummer 1. Yeah, Easy Drummer 1. So just using the very straightforward pop rock grooves, um, just quarter notes on the hi-hat, hard closed. So I need to familiarize myself with the beat one more time. When you turn on Okay, boom, ka, boom, boom, ka. Gotcha. So we got. Yeah, so I need one of those. And then there's the kind of like this. Do, do, ka, do, 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 I think. When you turn, when you turn on your TV. Yeah. Boom, ba ba boom, ba boom, ba. So we got boom, ba ba boom, ba boom, ba. Boom, ba ba boom, ba ba, boom, ba ba boom, ba boom, ka. Right, so we got.
I think that's the whole beat. So we have this. Yep, and then bring this guy all the way up to 127, Velasata. And this is now gonna be a crash. In fact, let's... Cool. And then... Get you back down. Probably should have done this after the fact. What's this? 80. We'll do that and Okay, cool. And let's just compare it quickly to the original. When you turn on your TV Make sure it's tuned to Channel 3. He's got a nerdy shirt. Okay, so there's that little snare fill in there that I want to get to before we go on to the pre chorus. So, boom, ba -ba, boom, ba -boom, ba -ba, ba -ba. So there's that little, yeah, snare fill. So we got. Ba -ba, ba -ba. Velocity. Yeah, it's a little bit better. All right, so here is verse one drums. He's gonna take you back to the past to play the shitty games that suck ass. Okay, and here it is without cursing. So I think this beat remains throughout the entire YouTube version of the song. I'm not sure yet, so I need to check. So I'll be right back. Okay, yeah, so doing some inspecting of the pre-chorus and the chorus, it seems like it's this beat throughout, so. Just do that. And I will deal with the fills later. So we got this. Wow. I feel like I just want to keep it one tempo. Let's do 114. One fourteen. Sounds good. Add some variation here and there. Yeah, I'll deal with that later. I'm already getting <laughs> carried away. All right, so drums are done. Now let's move on to guitar. So we got this all. All right, so there's the verse. So I'm just gonna do some uh, searching for a guitar tone real quick and then I'll be right back. 
Okay, I'm back, and that actually didn't take too long. Uh, I'm still messing around with the Archetype Nolly plugin from Neural DSP, as you can see here. And um, this is the Blasted Brit preset, which felt really good right out of the gate. <laughs> Super warm. I like it. So, so right now, even though we're in the key of F minor, we are using all power chords right now. So we're just stripping away the third from each of the chords. So we'll just call it for what it is right now. They're all fives. So it's going to be F, A flat, G, C, and that's going to repeat twice. So here we go. Actually, before I even get into that, let's do our low latency mode, make sure we're in tune. We're good. Okay, cool. Click initiated. And it's a very, you know, free form kind of feeling when we're playing it. And immediately upon playing it, it feels too fast. All right, let's go back down to 109, what I initially had. Let's see how that feels. Take you back to the past. Let's do one more. It feels pretty good. Let's move on to. the pre-chorus now. So pre-chorus is A flat, E flat, F, E flat, D flat times two. So As you can see, I just doubled the drums. Thankfully, this is the exact same beat, so I can get away with that right now. Probably wouldn't be able to otherwise, but all right. And you know what? Just to familiarize myself, I just want to hear it again. Yeah, so I don't want to syncopate it. Okay. Ding, ding, do, 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 do. Here we go. It felt a little weird. All right. 
right, let's try that again. Hmm, now what if I just kind of like did Yeah, that could be cool because then there's like that little thinness in the first half of the pre-chorus and then you thicken it up to kind of build up that tension to be released in the chorus at the end. Yeah, let's try that. Two, three, four. So, one, two, three, perfectionist comes into play and quite like the feel of that so I want to do that again one two three <laughs> All right. One. Two. So I want to make sure that that rhythm is right. Angriest gamer you've ever heard. Boom, 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 boom. Angriest gamer you've ever heard. Okay. Pretty good. Let's do that again. And there you have it. Um, I might do vocals later. I don't know. We'll see what happens. But let's hear how it sounds in full. We'll be right back.
All right, so there you have it. Uh, there is a very rough outline of the AVGN theme, and I am gonna play around with this because you know every time I listen to the song, I, I notice things here and there that I want to just try out differently, like just subtle things. Like I notice how the hi hat is going on throughout the entire song, so it'd be cool to kind of swap out the hi hat for the ride during the chorus or maybe incorporating some different fills, or maybe just experimenting with, you know, halftime feel versus double time feel, or maybe even just turn it into a complete full on metal version or something else, I don't even know. But I have this rough idea, you know, all laid out, and uh, I'm gonna explore this in a little bit. And if you've been following along, then I encourage you to do the same. And if you do, let me know. Let me know if you, um, you know, come up with your own version of this and post it on YouTube and, and definitely give me a shout. I want to check it out. So thanks for watching. I will see you later.